Welcome back to the Knowledge Academy's YouTube channel. Today, I'm super excited to show you how you can host your own website for free using GitHub Pages. It's an awesome way to share your projects or even create your own personal site. Whether you're a developer, designer, or just someone looking to get online, GitHub Pages has got you covered. So let's dive right in. First, and the foremost thing is to set up your GitHub account, if you haven't already. It's a quick and easy process. Open your Google Chrome and type GitHub, then click on the official GitHub account and click on Sign Up, then a new page will open here. Enter your email ID and set password. Then set a suitable available username, then click on Continue. Now click on Verify and solve the puzzle as shown in the screen. Verify your email by entering the code that is sent to your mail. Congratulations, you have successfully created a GitHub account. Now let's proceed forward. After this login with the username and password, which you have set while signing up, then it will ask some question. If you have a new account, fill in the details according to your need. In the subscription section, go with Continue for Free tab. Once that's done, your page will look something like this. Next step is creating your new repository. First head over to your profile, click on it and go to your repository. Here click on New tab present on right side and give a name to it. If it's your personal website, name it your username.github.io. This ensures it'll be available at your username. For other projects, choose a name that suits your project. Keep it in public. If you want, you can also add a readme file. Click on Create Repository. Third step is uploading your website files. Make sure you have an index.html file as the entry point of your site. You can upload files either using GitHub's user-friendly drag and drop feature or upload it from Choose You File option. Once uploaded, click on Commit Changes. Likewise, you can upload other HTML files which are connected to it. For example, you might want to add about .html file with it, so you can do that in the same way. Next step is configuring GitHub Pages. Let's set up GitHub Pages. Go to your repository settings, navigate to the Pages section. Set your branch, usually main, and choose the root directory. Then click Save, and GitHub will start processing your site. Now last and final step is check and publishing. After a few minutes, your site will be visible. Simply refresh the GitHub Pages link. And voila, your website is now hosted and accessible to the world. And there you have it, folks. Hosting your website on GitHub Pages is not only easy, but also completely free. Whether it's your portfolio, a project, or just a fun experiment, GitHub Pages provides a fantastic platform to showcase your work. I hope this tutorial was helpful for you. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more exciting and informative content. Don't forget to turn on notifications so you never miss an update. Happy coding!